What up guys, Bob's back with another episode of Retro Hunting and today we are getting some Mega Drive games. I've been back on old Carousel again. To be honest, I was looking for a, a wrestling game and then I found a couple of holes here which I think are just going to be unreal. So uh, let's check them out. Okay, so the first lot here is $100 for, boom, these seven games. Now the ones that are sticking out to me are... Power Rangers the movie, the game, pretty sure that's Golden Axe and Golden Axe 2. I don't know what that middle one is. Fighting Masters, no idea what that one is. Spider-Man, hell yeah, and Burning Force, a racing game. So these seven games for a hundred bucks. And then he's also told me that he has um, two Sonic games as well. And Quack Tales, which is one that I've been looking for for ages. So I'm going to see how much he wants to add those two to the listing as well and uh yeah we'll see what we get and here is another game boom that i've been looking for well i've been looking for any wrestling game on the mega drive but wrestle war 40 bucks this is a different dude but uh uh pick up at the same time in the same location so we're gonna grab that as well add it to the collection game on okay guys just on my way to pick up these mega drive games now uh, he said he's got four extra boxed games, which I can have for a hundred bucks. Uh, I know two of them are Sonic, um, and one of them are Quacktails. I don't know what the fourth game is, but pretty pumped to grab those as well. And grabbing WrestleFest off this other guy. So, beautiful weather today for game hunting. See you guys in a bit. Peace. Okay guys, I am back home. Got my haul of Mega Drive games. Let's check out what we've got. Okay, so let's go into our goodie bag. First of all, Wrestle War, which we got off the other guy for 40 bucks, but he met me in the same station. Amazing. Looks like it's in pretty good condition too. I don't know if it's new, but uh, nicely packaged anyway. And then these are the four extras that he threw in for me. So, I already have Sonic 1, so now we've got Sonic 2. Sonic 3. Awesome. And also, Street Fighter Championship Edition. And boom, a quack shot. It is in Japanese, but this was a game that me and my sisters used to play religiously. This was one of our main games, so I got major nostalgia feels for that one. And then also he chucked in this uh, game adapter, which basically means that I can buy Genesis games, and they all fit on the top of there, and they will fit in my Sega Mega Drive. So I don't have to worry about uh, regions or anything, which is epic. And then we go on to the games that uh, were in the main listing. So it is, we've got Golden Axe 2, Power Rangers the movie, the game, Spider-Man, Burning Force, and Golden Axe 1, nice, look at that artwork, that's awesome. Um... Fighting Masters, never heard of that one. And this is a random Chinese game that I have no idea, no idea about. So, uh, yeah. So, all in all, a pretty epic haul. 12 games plus the game adapter for $240. So, I am super pumped about that. I paid an extra 100 bucks for these four. And then $40 for Wrestle War plus the 100 for the other seven. So, uh, yeah. Another epic haul to add to my uh, Mega Drive collection. What is up guys, Bob's back. And uh, I've just been talking to a guy online. Since I got suckered in with the Game Gear and the Game Boy Advances, I figured, ah, if I find a good deal on a handheld, I'm gonna pick it up. So today I found a guy who's selling a Nintendo DS with the stylus working for 50 Hong Kong dollars. So, I mean, that's an absolute bargain. I can't believe that. So uh, I'm just, he just sent me a bunch of photos now and uh, yeah, let's, let's check it out. Okay, so here is the DS. Looks in pretty good shape. He told me he's tested it and it's working. Um, so there's a couple of little scratches on the top, but I mean, it looks pretty good to me. I'm pretty happy with that for $50. So uh, yeah, gonna go meet him today and it doesn't have a charger, so I'm gonna have to pick one of those up as well. But um, that shouldn't be too difficult. So I'm gonna check on Carousel now. And yeah, go pick me up a DS. Let's do this thing. Okay, so here I found a DS charger for NDS, $68, in the middle of nowhere, but who cares, 68 bucks, jump on the MTR, gonna go meet this guy right now. Okay guys, 
DS acquired. It's in pretty good shape. Looks pretty good. 50 Hong Kong dollars, a worthy addition to the collection. Now let's go pick up some games for it. All right, let's do this. Okay, so here is the listing. Mario Kart and Final Fantasy 12 for the DS. Just loose in box, but $50. Now, I'm not sure if it's $50 each or $50 for both, so I'm gonna hit him up right now and, uh, and see what I can do. If I can get 50 for both, that would be absolutely incredible. What is up guys, so out hunting again and I just picked up the DS uh, Final Fantasy and Mario Kart for the DS for $50 for both. Now I'm sure I can sell both of these games for between 50 and 100 each. So this is an amazing deal. So now I'm also in, a usually all these stations are absolutely rammed. And this is how you know I've traveled to the ends of the earth for this uh, DS charger because look around, there's no one. There's literally two people. It is great. Oh, there you go. A train must have just come in. I've never seen a train station in Hong Kong so empty. It is insane. I'm going to grab the charger and then we've got a full DS collection. Game on. Uh, just so you guys can gauge just how far I've come to get this DS charger, right? Usually I pick up all my games around here. Sham Shui Po, Shep Kip Mei. Occasionally I'll come out here. Uh, well, not really, actually. It's usually along these lines, whatever. Today... I am not even of stay on the brown line, Meifu, up, 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 Long ping. So this is China. Okay, I'm literally on the Chinese border picking up a DS charger. So DS charger acquired. So now we have five games for the DS, the charger and the console itself. So now let's get our ass home and test it out. Fingers crossed it works. Booyah. Okay guys, so I've been watching some retro Rick and I've recently learned about the power of the ask where he goes to all these flea markets and everything. But if you don't ask if they have any video games or anything, then you'll never know. And half the time he does that, people go, oh, actually we have this GameCube or we have this Wii or whatever in the back. Let me go get it for you. So I tried to do something similar, but as I don't have flea markets and stuff to go to, I did it on Facebook. I'm the admin of one of the local Discovery Bay groups called DB Matters and So Do Our Opinions. So I just posted on there, um, if there's anybody, in fact, I'll just show you. Here, check out my post. So here's the post. Hey guys, if there is anyone in DB who has any old gaming consoles or games like Nintendos, Xbox, Game Boys just sitting in a cupboard gathering dust, please let me know as I'd be interested in taking them off your hands. One of my buddies, Mark, just said, Speak to Bob O'Kane, dumbass. But then Darren Connolly got in touch. I've got an Xbox 360 you can have. So I said, Really? That would be amazing. One of the only consoles I haven't picked up yet. Do you have the cables and stuff for it? Can I at least buy you a few beers? And then he came back again. Comes with the cables and power supply. I'm trying to cut down the, on the beers. Perhaps a bottle of wine. Absolute legend, Darren Connolly. Okay guys, just on my way to pick up the Xbox 360 off of Darren. Got a nice bottle of red wine for you here, mate. Thank you so much for this. Um, he's left it at the concierge for me. And he actually, I found out he only lives about a two minute walk away from my, my building. So just popping around there now to pick it up. Drop off the bottle of wine for you. Thank you very much, Xbox 360. Let's do this. Hello, good morning. I'm just here to pick up... Um... Yes, I am. Oh, amazing. Thank you so much. And then, so, yeah, so if you could just please also pass this bottle of wine to him when he comes back. Okay, Darren. That's for him, yes, for Darren. Okay, no Perfect, problem. thank you very much. Okay, guys, got the wheel, the pedals, the system back in there. It also... A whole thing of games, which is amazing. I didn't realize that was being thrown in there. Thank you, Darren. Absolute legend. Let's do this. Okay, team, we are back. I've just picked up the Xbox from Darren. Darren, you absolute hero. Thank you so much. Um, a little bit different today because I've got the bear with me because I know um, that this is going to be quite funny. So, you know I've got an Xbox 360. 
for a bottle of wine. This looks far So she's too seen the size big. of the bag. Because. No space for any more. So, first of all, which I didn't realize, he threw in a whole thing of games. So we'll go through this in a minute. Amazing. And then we have our. Here we go. One controller in very good shape. A second controller. Is that wired? Oh no, it's just with a sensor thing. Also in very good shape. Which I'll leave those in there. We'll go through the games in a set. And now here you go, Bear. So I have the Xbox 360, right? And then it comes with. No! Some, foot, some driving foot pedals. No! And what are foot pedals gonna come with? The steering wheel. A big motherfucking steering wheel! Oh, no, come on! <laughs> Look at that! <laughs> with foot pedals, it's gonna be fucking awesome! But it is the that size is of the console, fun. but... No. For a bottle of wine, this is an fucking incredible deal! Booyah! Hell yizzle! Look at that! And then, of course... Oh! The Xbox 360. See, look, very good shape. So, Xbox 360. Driving, we're gonna have to play this later. It's gonna be awesome. Uh, Xbox 360. Oh, actually, let's take a look at some of the games. Games included. We have, there better be a racing game in here. <laughs> oh, Kinect Star Wars. Uh, Forza 2 Motorsport. There we go. That's one we can use it with. Viva Pinata. There you go. See? It's not just for me. Ace Combat 6. Lego Indiana Jones. Ridge Racer 6. See? Another game we can use for that. Formula 1. Oh my god. They're all games we can use the wheel for. Burnout Paradise. Frontliners, Fuel of War, never heard of that. Project Gotham Racing, another one. Star Wars, The Clone Wars. Project Gotham Racing 3. Oh my god, this is amazing. Xbox Live Arcade. Heroes Over Europe, never heard of that. And Battle Stations Midway. Oh no, there's more. <gasps> but what tell us? Yes! I just downloaded Virtual Tennis on the emulators. Love a bit of Virtual Tennis. Star Wars The Clone Wars. Minecraft. Battle Stations Pacific. Gears of War 3. Oh my god, this is amazing. Lego Batman 3. Indiana Jones 2. Lego. What? And F1 2014. Oh, and Burnout Paradise Ultimate. Boom! So a huge plethora of games that we can use with our giant wheel. Look how happy the bear is. Yeah, woo! Racing games, racing games. We're actually afraid to go <laughs> to this expo. And we're also going to RetroCon today. So we're going to buy even more stuff. Come on! Woo, 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 woo. Xbox, Xbox. All right, catch you guys in a bit. Peace.